Beard, I see you there! Thor! Why do you call? A challenge! Will you face me in flighting? I will accept your challenge and teach you a lesson through humiliation. Now speak, that I might hear the strength of your convictions. Come and flight me, all father! It's time to perform! I'm the ruler of thunder, you're caught in the storm! Cross the water and meet me, I'll show you my might! Oh, beware what you ask for! I will finish the fight! Not bad, old man! I have slain giants and monsters, I am endlessly brave! I am adored by the masses from warrior to slave! You are the worst of the Aesir, a coddled old clod! I'm as wise as an owl! You're a fool of a god! Hmm! You were lucky! Shame serves as your shadow wherever you roam! Your failure's the point, and I'll hammer it home! You're a simpering greybeard who will soon meet his end! Well, your victory's not what my visions portend. Ugh, better than I thought. Describe defeat for me, Thor. I do not know the taste. This setback will only drive me to get better, to get stronger, and I will return and crush you with my wit.
do you see, Sunan? Need to be careful here.
Welcome back. Your face is bright, and your eyes seem clearer. Tell me of everything you have seen. I have... Uh, I've been to Asgard, the seat of the gods. I saw through Odin's eyes, just as you said. In every vision, I inhabited his form, lived as he once lived. In his body, I was myself. I was carried by his whims. His thoughts were as known to me as my own. We were two, but we existed as one. And what have you learned? More than learned. I felt, I felt everything. His fears and doubts, his loves and passions. Incredible. What else? I consorted with Loki, the trickster. We quarreled often as siblings. But soon our fight grew dark. When he revealed he had sired a wolf cub, my rage was unbound. Because he had hid the truth from you? Yes, because he knew that wolves were not allowed in Asgard. He flaunted my command. Perhaps this was the purpose of your vision. To overcome an inner fear and find forgiveness in your heart. Maybe. But before my vision ended, I was seized by great purpose. I devised a plan, a voyage to Jotunheim. And then I awoke. Interesting. Was there anything else? I heard a prophecy. Warning of Ragnarok, the destruction of the world, the end of all time. And the Nordnir. They warned me of the great wolf Fenrir and how he hungered for my blood. But there was something else. Hope. I was undaunted by the coming cataclysm. 
Perhaps this aspect of your vision inspires bravery. Truly, you are touched by the gods. Was there more? There was nothing more. Nothing of great significance. The dream has faded. Eivor, your visions are unlike any I have encountered. Leave me now. I must think on what you have shared. turn. She won't talk to me. Eivor will handle it. Go on. You have exhausted my friend Uber here, but I'm wide awake. Maybe tell me where Burkrit is hiding and let him rest happy. Never. Stone-faced and tight-lipped, all for a king who hides like a cowardly vole, too scared to protect his family and his people. Thirsty? <laughs> my husband does what he must for Mercia. How could he do otherwise? Knowing that even his closest friends could betray him. Give that traitor Cheowulf my message. He may win this earthly battle, but the devil has won the war for his soul. Cheowulf is a Mercian doing his best to find common footing in this new land. Seems to be the only true Mercian by my reckoning. I spit on him. Whatever life he makes in Mercia will be built on the graves of the nobles who gave their lives to defend it. The longer you drag this out, the truer that becomes. We've taken Repton, Tamworth, now Templebroth, and Letterchester. With each victory, your hope for peace recedes. Yet Borbred has what you do not. The loyalty of his people. Good men. Faithful men. Who? The Thanes and Chills of Mercia? No, no. Only Leofrith remains loyal, and he too will fall. Yes, goodly Leofrith. He will die defending his king. And win or lose, he will send a hundred more of you to hell. Eivor, your ladyship, do not mind me. Only here to count my spoils. Oh, God! Pigs have to eat, my lady. The trouble is, it takes a lot to sate their hunger. Only a matter of time before they finish those and sniff around for fresher meat. And the smell of pig shit after this? Ooh. My... my god! 
Get me out of here! Please! Talk now, and we'll draw you a nice warm bath. You... You are asking me to betray my husband. How can I do that? If you don't, you will betray countless others. In legend, you may be remembered as the king and queen who abandoned their kingdom in its darkest hour. But there will be peace. This is Jailwolf's promise, and it will be honored. You have my word. Does the caged bird sing? Burkrit is hiding, in an old crypt to the south, where the Alnir and Arrow Rivers join. A crypt? Now tell me this is not a sign from the gods. It's a long way to carry a king. The three of you must clear a path back to Tamworth. Where can we meet? Bring him to the bridge at Venonus. It's a straight line through. We'll deal with any trouble there. How many more times will I have to curtail your spectacles, Ivar? Spectacle? That's just me. Pile the soldiers here. Let these people bear witness to the carnage that awaits their kingdom. I should be cautious around here.
served and prayed under St. Chad at Tamworth. I was a monk. I should have stayed there. Did St. Chad die with his axe in his hand? St. Chad will be revered for avoiding the axe. I wish I had done so myself, but not taken a path full of violent honor. The old gods will fade from our sight in time. God forgive me for I have sinned. <laughs> What is your name? May. Eivor. Something about this tree important to you? It's the leaves. My father said he would return home before they'd all fall into the ground. And now, only one remains. And still no return. It's been six weeks. Six weeks since he's gone to Lincoln in search of work. I wish he stayed. Just one more season. He was so sure the fields wouldn't yield, but we could have tried. All I can say for certain is that this leaf will fall. You should hope for the best, but prepare for the worst. That way, if your father never returns, your heart will not break. But if he does, you will weep with joy. I haven't thought of it that way, but it is a simple idea to live by. You're right. I must carry on, with or without him. Thank you, Eivor. May the Lord be with you. Maybe... Maybe I'll wait just a little bit longer. Till the goats begin to bray, or... Ah! What? No! No, no, no! You... Ah. I suppose that's it, then. Carry on with your life, May. Everything will be all right. Show me what lies ahead. Heavy <laughs> <laughs> go. 
hard for a musty crypt. Cannot be the dead they're protecting. going on? His lordship wouldn't say. Strictest confidence. Was it the king's orders? And the rest of us are just supposed to stay here, like sitting ducks. If you don't cut your wailing, that's exactly what we'll be. So keep your voice down. But I don't like this. Not one bit. to be down here. Where are you hiding, Burkrit?
No! No, 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 it can't be! Stay back! That's a bread knife, my lord. Do you mean to butter me? Stay back! Back, I say! I'll fight you! If you insist. You have to kill me! Luckily for you, it won't come to that. This kingdom is mine! Mine! Mm -hmm. Time to go, my lord. We're late for the crowning ceremony. Off this thing. You, you, you think you've won? You haven't. Lyafrit. I, I sent him away with orders to destroy you. Lyafrit, I, I sent him away with orders to destroy you. Quiet. The mess you're in, you don't know the half of it. You're a blight on this world. The whole lot of you, a rancid dis... We need to go! Fast! Right behind you. I'm here! Free the king! Go! Go! Ah, put me down! The only way you go down is with a rope around your neck. 
They'll be coming for him. Stay alert. Here we are. Look familiar? No. No, you... You godless slugs. You won't get away with this. What's that? Change has come, Burgred. All that remains is a coronation. A witten with the Lords of Mercia. Burgred, my love! My lady, are you injured? Did they hurt you? No, no. I'm fine. Move along, Lord. Your king awaits. Your death will come, Danes. Your end was writ the moment you came for me. I have made damn sure of that. The Zealots will know your name soon enough. No matter where you are or how far you travel, they will hunt you down. Enough of that, you squeaking sparrow. <laughs> Let my brother be the lunatic of Tamworth. Zealots? What does he mean? Ignore him. Desperate pleas and prophecies. Nothing more. Walk with me, Wolfkist. We have some time before the ceremony. Where to? Nowhere in particular. I only want to celebrate. Didn't think you were the type. You have drawn a dark conclusion about me, haven't you? That is all well and good. I've drawn some about you as well. Are you leading a lamb to slaughter? See what I mean? Dark. Too dark. You there! Get... Sit down. I know I have been a cock. But you are a good fighter. I respect that. Let it be said... That Ivar the Boneless considers Eivor a friend. Who calls you Boneless? Some backrout I killed in Hibernia. Used his guts to shine my spear. Called me Boneless because I move like a reed in the wind. Not because you're always too drunk to plow? Valhalla. That is where I am bound. I can smell the blood and taste the mead. I will sit beside the High One with my axe in hand. A fitting end for Arachnason. You would think, eh? Me, Hafton, we will be there. But Uba... No. I do not think we are chasing the same victory. Not anymore. What does Uba want? To grow old and fat on the farm somewhere with little Ubas to chase about. <sighs> he wants an heir. It's a common dream. Not for a warrior. Not for Drengir like us. He was different before. But this place, England, it softened him. What was he like before? Like me. Ferocious. Wild. With respect, I don't think anyone is like you. If that is a compliment, I missed it. All I mean to say is, things were easier some time ago. If it bothers you so much, why not strike out on your own? Because he is my brother. I love him. And I will do what it takes to drag him back around to my way of thinking. We are warriors, all. And that is to the death. again. Oh, did I miss the crowning? Hello. 
Santos! Flächen! How much did we drink? I don't remember this at all. Where is my son? We sent word to Repton, but we've had no word, Lord. I suggest we carry on. You sought me out, old friend. And here I am, standing before the throne from which I reigned not long ago. You stand before us to accept this Witten's unanimous decision that you are unfit to rule and are hereby deposed. We demand the abdication of your kingdom and your crown to Thane Chairwolf. Mercia has spoken, Lord. The crown. Is that you, old friend? Ah, yes, I see it now. Forgive me. The robes of righteousness sit so loosely upon your shoulders. If the heavens mismark me as king, forgive its obscuring light. Amen. Now, where is my crown? Forgive my nerves. Here I am, an upright man who never once learned how to bend the knee. And yet, I shall try. Ah, how simple it is. How easy to kneel without fear and feeling. He's mocking you, man. I'd kill the fucker. Worry not, Dane. I shall resign this crown and this pagan-infested kingdom and the favors of these two-faced men. But I will do so on my terms. My demands are simple. Firstly, you must... <coughs> you fool. Look around you. You have no leverage here. Plead for your life. For it is the only thing these men will grant you. Yes. Yes. Forgive me, I, I... Do not harm me. I beg of you. Please. I'll go anywhere. Here. I, 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 I resign it. Here. Take this lord and his wife to Rome. He is hereby exiled. Never to return. The Witten recognizes King Chairwolf of Mercia, second of his name. A just king, a merciful king. God save the king! It better be worth all this trouble. Mercian soldiers marching on Repton! Leofrith, loyal to the ugly and the bastard. Gather what men you have and split them between the north and south gates. That should divide his forces. 
Cheobert is there. Eivor, you must save my son. He will come through this, I promise. I will stay here with Cheobert. Go. Any sign of Chilbert? No. My boy is lightly cowering in the Keep an eye out. Seen Chelbert? No, but we caught sight of Leo fleeing across the river. He was chasing someone. It has to be Chelbert. He is the only prize worth taking in this mutsy. You won't be Show me. Jailbound. He's in trouble. Walk back down, Leofrey. I will not. Please, you do not want to do this. Leofrey, let him walk. You answer to me. I answer to my king. Our silence deeds with this. Lay it by, Leofred. There's nothing left to fight for. We've stormed Repton. Only a matter of time. I cannot do that. Then you will die. Someone will. You can't win this, Leofrid. Even if you defeat me, the Rachnesons have won the day. I have fought many a day in my time. I'm still standing. You're slowing. You are a strong-willed Thane. Urquid was lucky. To stand in the way of you and Mercia is my duty. I will die. You're finished. Not yet. Fight me, heathen. Go on, then. 
End it. No appeal to your god. Or your king. I swore an oath to serve Borgrid to the death. I fought. I lost. We both know how this goes. An honorable thane fighting a dishonorable war. Burkrid abandoned him, betrayed his trust. If I were Leofrib, I would want to know. Why rob him of this last glory? A warrior ready to meet his god and bask in his praise. To live will only lead him to shame. It's not an oath he would keep if he knew the truth. Then choose. Truth or glory. Stand, Leofrid. Live to fight another day. What? Your loyalty to Burkrid is not a loyalty returned. He resigned the crown and fled to Rome. He's gone. You lie. Lie to a man seconds from death? What would I gain? He saved himself and left you to die. All this fighting, it's for nothing. For no one. To betray one so trusted. So close. It's a dishonor worth a thousand deaths. Eivor, you have shown me a great kindness. It, it is only fitting that I do the same. At Venonis, there is a statue with a scroll laid in a small bowl. You must burn it. A scroll? Your name is on this scroll. At Burgred's request, I put it there. When it is found, the zealots who read it will hunt you. Who are they? It doesn't matter now, you haven't much time. Burn the scroll, or they will never stop hunting you. And where will you go now? Rome. Come on, let's take you back. Careful, you're injured. I'm all right, really. A few nicks and cuts from the battle, that's all. These wounds will heal quickly. You're lucky. I threw myself at him, Abel. But he only toyed with me. He knew I couldn't touch him. You should have stayed hidden. Jailbird, this wasn't your fight. It was. It was our fight. Yours, mine, my father's. I had to help. And you did. You showed courage today. Bravery. You are a boy no longer. Back there with Leofrid. I didn't think you'd spare him. There's no honor in killing a man misled. He believed his king would die fighting for Mercia. He knows the truth now. And... With that truth, he forges a new path. You were right about him, Jailbat. And right to believe the line that divides us can be thinner than it seems. Jailbert! Look at you! Bloody and battle-worn. Could be chieftain of your own clan with courage like that. No less than the King of Mercia, brother. One of these days... And how is my father taking to his new role? See for yourself. You are an Otlinger now. Or Athling, I think you'd say. Next in line for the throne. It's an honorable title. One that demands good judgment. Be careful who you trust. My son. Are you well? Yes, father. Well enough. He honored you today. Fought bravely against many stalwart foes. You have my thanks. All of you. And my blessing. What happens now? Word of Burgred's deposition will spread quickly. The other kingdoms of England will soon enough know that Mercia has a new king. The remaining kingdoms of England won't respect your path to power. Nor will many in my kingdom. Burgred's soldiers will stand tall in the face of this turmoil, all across Mercia. 
against us. That we shall remedy soon enough. I am riding for Oxenifordshire directly, to forge an alliance with some thanes there. Shall I go with you? Not till I know more. Linger here a while if you can. Strengthen our friendships. I will send for you soon enough. Sigurd, I would feel better if Cheobert was away from here until Mercia is more stable. Would you welcome him among your clan? Hmm. Do you have a horse, young Adeling? I do. A young steed called Theobald. Good. I can ride with you as far as the river Nene. You may find your way from there. Thank you, Sigurd. This puts my mind at ease. Be ready for my call, Eivor. It will come. You and Sigurd make a good pair. The future of England will be pagan from top to bottom. Take this, Wolfkist. It's a sign of friendship. And should you call, the brothers Ragnarsson will come. You honor me, Uba. See that? Slight bastard trying to win your heart. Well, two can play at that game. How kind of you, Ivar. My pleasure. Our friendship is the best thing to come from this mess. Maybe Chelbert too, the brave little twig. That is good to hear. Now then, Leofrit said there are hunters after me. Zealots. If I don't clear my name, I will be marked for death. I should head to Venonis. Seems the wind calls me back to Rantvi. Let's tell her the good news.